Gamar Joba, everyone. Let's unbox a tripod. I do have a monopod, but I don't have a tripod. So, this is the first tripod unboxing. Let's begin. Also, this is going to be a very quick unboxing video. I'll make a part 2 video to go more in depth for this tripod. This is the iFootage Gazelle TA6 tripod. Before pulling out the product, let's take a look around the box. You got the logo, iFootage. And then you have the Gazelle Fastball. I'm really excited about this tripod. NAB 2019 was this year and iFootage launched a new tripod series. This video is not sponsored. And then there's information about the lengths of the tripod. And then on this side, it tells all the different models. I'll get into that at the end of the video. So keep watching, please. Let's pull out the product. The iFootage Gazelle TA6 comes with a case. Comes with a shoulder strap to carry this bag, a handle, it has a velcro, the zipper has a plastic, and you can adjust the shoulder strap also. And very smooth zipper. Paperwork, thank you iFootage for giving free stickers, that's awesome. Warranty card, instruction, and other paperwork, and iFootage certificate. The iFootage tripod case has a padding to it, so it'll definitely protect the iFootage TA6 Gazelle. It also extends, so you can put your fluid head in here. So fluid head and the tripod and there's a lot of room to put stuff or any other equipment you can put into this extra storage the way you fold it is you just push inward and there's a strap it holds in place the extra storage compartment inside the bag you get a pocket you can put equipment in here let's put all this paperwork and bag aside great job on the packaging by the way iFootage let's take a look around the iFootage Gazelle TA6 uprise tripod from the bottom you have rubber feet and if you screw this inward you get spikes and those spikes are for to hold the tripod very very solid on rough terrain dirt rocks etc and then screwing this outward it hides the spikes in total there are six buckles and these buckles are easy to lock and unlock this whole tripod is aluminium the buckles are aluminium the weight hook is aluminium the center pole is aluminium. Everything is aluminium. This is a very, very well-built tripod. It'll definitely last for a long time. Continuing on, you got a adjustment tool. And this adjustment tool is to adjust the screws to tie in or loosen. 
So that's really awesome eye footage to give this free tool. On the top, you have a 3 8 inch so you can place your flute head and this bolt head moves. There are two locking mechanisms on the top. The first one is to unlock the bowl and you can move it around. There is a bubble level to let you know if you are leveled or not. So if you're traveling and you don't want to carry a small ball head, this will definitely work because the, the way it angles is actually pretty good. I'm even surprised how well this actually, this bowl works. So even if you have a fluid head and you place the fluid head on top of this tripod, you can make those easy micro adjustments, which is really, really convenient. The bottom one is to unlock and lock the center pole. You twist it right, you unlock it. You twist left, you lock it. Very basic and easy to remember. And then you can move the center pole. And then you lock the center pole, whatever the height that you need. And then to remove this center pole to make a low angle tripod, all you have to do is twist left. Also on the bottom, there is a weight hook so you can place your backpack or sandbags to give it some weight if you're placing heavy equipment on top of this tripod. And so that if someone bumps into this tripod, that it won't fall over. And so it's really convenient to have a weight hook. Make sure that the center pole is all the way down and then you lock it. And then you continue twisting this. And it removes. What's quite interesting is that it has a quarter inch. So you can use this as a selfie stick in a way. Now that you removed the center pole, you can also remove this bowl head. Unlock this and there is the bowl head. On the top of the bowl head, it has this rubber to grip that camera so it doesn't move all over the place. It gives a nice grip to it. On the side, 3 8 inch to place a extension arm. So if you want a studio solid tripod, I would definitely recommend the iFootage Gazelle TSX Uprise. There's an awesome feature that you can do with this tripod. It is a underslung feature. And the way that you do that is you place this the center pole. You take the bowl and you place it underneath. And then you twist it. and it locks in. And then you can have those nice, awesome, low angle shots. And of course you can unlock and lock this bowl. And make sure that you hold this in place because when you unscrew the center, this will fall out. So make sure that you're holding the bowl because you don't want to drop a very expensive camera. The way you spread the legs, there is a locking mechanism to lock the legs. And all you have to do is just pull these, this locking mechanism and then you can adjust it. You start from the top, so that's one adjustment, then two adjustment, and then three. So you get three adjustments for the legs. The buckle is really easy to unlock and lock and then you just pull this out and you can adjust the height that you want to. You can grab this tripod in two different materials. This one is aluminum. You can also grab a lighter tripod, which is made out of carbon fiber. There are four different models. TA6, which is the tripod that we are reviewing right now. TC6, TA5, and TC5. Spread angles of the legs are 22 degrees, 55 degrees, and 80 degrees. Max height is 1,650 millimeters. Folded is 635 millimeters. The weight of the iFootage Gazelle TA6 Uprise is 2.34 kilograms. Waterproof and anti-corrosion. iFootage went into great detail making this tripod. Even the screws are labeled iFootage. The buckles are labeled iFootage. And there's even the logo of Gazelle 
So they went into really great detail, even where the locking systems are. It tells you where to unlock and lock. So everything is detailed. Everything is really simple to use this tripod. It's durable. It's, it's just an amazing tripod for that price that you're paying for this tripod. If you thought this video was helpful, share it. If you like this video, click the like button. Click on the notification bell to get notified when there's a new video. And also, subscribe. Be brave, iFootage. Continue making awesome tripods, monopods, and sliders that no one ever designed the small little features that are really convenient. Until next time.